Hey, bull market bully family. Today, we're diving into IBM, one of the oldest tech giants now focusing on hybrid cloud and AI. Want to know what IBM's doing right and where they're challenged? Stick around till the end, like, comment, and subscribe for more stock insights every week. Let's start with a quick look at IBM. IBM, or International Business Machines, has evolved from punch card systems to a leader in hybrid cloud, AI, and quantum computing. Next, let's talk numbers. IBM's revenues have seen ups and downs, especially as they transition from older hardware. They bring in about $62 billion annually, with hybrid cloud and AI as main drivers. Profit margins are around 10%, indicating profitability, but not high growth. IBM has a strong dividend yield of over 3%, appealing to income-focused investors. Now let's look at IBM's place in the market. The cloud industry is red-hot, dominated by Amazon AWS, Microsoft Azure, and Google Cloud. IBM focuses on hybrid cloud, offering flexibility for enterprises combining private and public cloud options. Red Hat helps IBM differentiate with unique open source solutions across any cloud provider. IBM faces fierce competition in cloud and AI from Microsoft, Amazon, and Agile startups. IBM excels in complex, regulated industries like healthcare and finance, prioritizing security and compliance. Looking to the future, IBM is laser-focused on hybrid cloud, artificial intelligence, and quantum computing. They're partnering with SAP, AWS, and Microsoft to enhance their offerings. IBM Watson drives AI solutions while the quantum network aims to solve complex problems. Challenges remain with legacy hardware and high debt. IBM's success hinges on growing cloud and AI to offset declines in traditional revenue. Investment Strategies Is IBM a buy? Should you consider investing in IBM? For income-focused investors valuing stability and dividends, IBM is solid. The stock has low volatility, with a beta of 0.70, a good sign for conservative investors. IBM suits patient investors believing in hybrid cloud AI and quantum computing. All right, here's my final grade for IBM. I'd give it a B for income-focused investors, but for growth-focused investors, it's more of a C+, given IBM's slower growth. IBM's good for stability and dividends, but may not deliver explosive growth. Here's that bonus tip I promised. IBM's role in the rise of cybersecurity is significant. With products like IBM Curadar and Security Services, IBM is a major player in this field, poised for further growth. So there you have it folks, IBM is a solid player with exciting prospects. Hit like, comment your thoughts, and subscribe to Bull Market Bully. Stay bullish!